Welcome back to Louisiana Outdoor Experience. I want to apologize for the videos being so spaced in between. I know it's been about probably two, two and a half weeks somewhere in there since I posted the last one. For y'all that don't know, I live in Barataria, Louisiana and on August 29th, Hurricane Ida made landfall. This video will be about the day the storm made landfall, the day after, um, up until about a week after the storm made landfall. It took about a week for me to get home. So, now, there's been a little bit of cleanup while I'm filming the intro, but I just want to show y'all that I know I don't show up my back porch often, but let me show y'all. My porch was screened in. The top no longer has screens. But what I really wanted to show y'all was see these few sparse trees here? That used to be woods. This canal here that you can see, that's right about there, is where I filmed the Juglon Chronicles actually catching the fish. I had a line set in there at the other end of that canal. Um, I was never able to see that before the storm. If you haven't been watching us on Instagram, Facebook, or TikTok, which I'll leave the links to all of them in the descriptions below, we have been around about doing things um, this video some of it will be you'll see oh look I seen that in a short some of that um, a lot of the footage I have been trying to put out in shorts just so y'all kind of understand what's going on around here this is one of the strongest hurricanes to make landfall in Louisiana um, I don't know exactly where it's ranked. Uh, I know it's in the top three. Uh, or tied for the top three. I think the top three is kind of like Katrina, Ida, Laura, the Hurricane 1867, I believe. It's a long way to go. I don't know when regular scheduled outdoors stuff will be. Um, I'll be trying to do some upbeat, lighthearted stuff to keep my mind off of what's going on uh, thankfully me my wife my daughter are fine no damage to the house no my major damage to our house um, no flood so on that front we're good water coming in two hours the little b-road right here couldn't get it out the wind blew it down hope it don't come up no more uh, bad boat out here i 
ditches underneath the water. around the back. It look good, Frank. Compared to everybody else's. Look at the these way he's at. These way on the other side over there. We got a lot of more grass. Yeah, he's chest and all still underneath there. You said it looked like it hold up. I don't see too much damage on the house except uh, I never looked on the other side yet. I never looked on the other side. It's bad on your outside, boy. I thought the outside was bad. You got what's the name shit leaning against the house. The screen didn't porch. Looking all right. You know, just bust the string. <clears throat> Got some float thorns underneath the house and all. Boy, look at the D shot where it's at. At least the green don't hold. I thought it knocked that gas in the unit off, but it didn't. Barely didn't. No side and missing off of this side neither. That's amazing. So this is the first time I have been down to Lafitte since Hurricane Ida. Made landfall and it is September 4th and made landfall on 29th. This is the area where they were launching the rescue boats on the 30th of August. I don't know if you can see it. That's the water line. Better part of waste deep water. When your partner stays in the back of the feet and calls you to come help him get his house straight, this is what you gotta get through. We got the mud boat and everything. Whole ass chunks of land, bro. This ain't flow talk. This is float land. There's whole ass chunks out here. So now we're gonna try to figure something out. Y'all pray for us.
got a new pond in my backyard. See if I got food. You know, we will rebuild, we'll stay here. Pretty sure my neighbors are gonna stay for the most part. A lot of the bayous and everything around are just not what we remember, but we'll have to learn it new. It's a part of it though. We need to get up here and get at it. Make sure you hit that subscribe button. Just so that you can be entered into our giveaway when we reach 100 subscribers. If you watch the Matrix Sad unboxing video from I believe it was August. It'll show you what's kind of going to be in the giveaway when it comes up. Let me know what y'all think. Let me know if y'all want to see more of these hurricane videos. If y'all want to see more, well, more of the recovery of Hurricane Ida. It's what most of my life right now is going to be. Um, hopefully deer season now. I'm out there deer hunting, but it may be a while till we can do some actual hunting and fishing.